have with me someone that I admire because she has done phenomenal things with her life, you know, in terms of being an entrepreneur. She said she's an entrepreneur in training. I don't think so. I think she's already one. And it is my great pleasure to introduce my guest today for WCW, The Wednesday, Amanda Danraj. Hi. Hi, Amanda. How are you going? I'm good, man. I'm a little you bit good? sleepy, but you're I'm good. You're good? You mm -hmm. sure? Yeah, I'm good. All right, first things first. If you come on my show and you had thing in your hand, that had to be for me. <laughs> it wasn't, but, but it no. Wasn't? But no oh, I, gosh, I was a little presumptuous there. Right. Well, you'd rather give it? I could give it and take it back after the show. No problem, I'll do that. Yeah? I'll do that. So, so that means is... I can't open it? Of course you can. Because it's for me. It's for me, it's for me and you're lying because my name on it. You're lying. <laughs> so this is from the beauty lab. It's a the small beauty token. lab. Oh my gosh, oh. guys. You all see? This is the kind of stuff. When you all come on my show, bring me presents. I like presents. I like presents. I like presents. So, <laughs> so Amanda, tell mm. me. Give us a summary about yourself. I want I want the people out there to know who Amanda is. You know, in a nutshell. Like if you just had to tell us in about five words or maybe a sentence or a few, who's Amanda Danraj? I had a lot of things planned for this, eh? but yes. we break our plans. Never mind. If you had asked me this a couple years ago, I would have tell you I make a lot of money. For real? Yeah, and I have no friends, no social life. And I hate my job. Wow. That would have been a chemist. For real? Yes. So that's what you studied at school? Yes. Um, my internship was done at Johnson & Johnson sometime 1998 to 1999. And uh, I started working in the lab there mm -hmm. as a young lab technician. Okay. I know nothing about it. But uh, Neutrogena was one of their products. Right. And um, that's when I started to like makeup. Makeup. So I heard that you're a makeup artist. I am a makeup artist. Yeah. Um, yes, very Is much. Is it a so. passion or you just you're good at it? Both. Okay. Both. You have to have some kind of passion to be good at something, right? Okay. And uh, makeup is one of my passions. Um, as well as I try to maintain my professional forefront. Mm -hmm. I'm also a quality assurance con um, consultant. Health and safety as well. But I like the makeup. Nice. And since then, I've kind of stepped back from the professional world. Um, soon to pursue my MBA, though, because I think I want to be able to run my own business now. So is that bright girl? A little bit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a little bit. Well, that's what we like. That's what we like. And that's what we try to empower and let other women know that, listen, mm -hmm. education is important. It you is. Know? It's, it's a foundation. You don't necessarily have to end up where you study mm -hmm. or in the profession that you study for. Mm -hmm. Sometimes your passion takes you somewhere else, but just being educated sometimes pushes you in a direction that you never saw yourself. So this, is this what um, the beauty lab is all about? Is this makeup? So this is not makeup. Okay. We are, our core service is makeup application. Okay. I am the makeup artist. Okay. But in recent time with COVID hitting and mm. everybody wearing the same boring face mask. <laughs> I decided to glam it up a bit because I, I like glam so, and I like fashion. So what's in here? A face mask? Hey, Olia, I can rip, I like to rip things. Olia, rip it. You can because do what so, you want. That's so nice. I don't want to, I hurt the box. I don't like to hurt people box, you know. Woo! Look at, hey! Okay, where is this? This looking like, where is it, where in here? I should open this first. Is this one of the masks that you were just talking about? Yes. Ooh, oh, the look. I felt like this would have been your style. Because I like bling things, yes. yes. You what like look? the bling. What the thing? I find her looking like a gypsy. <laughs> I like this. Okay, it has something else in here? Something else in there. You think I'll give it such a big box with a tiny Listen, girl? Listen, well, I wanted to know. I didn't want to say nothing. I didn't want to be... <gasps> what is this? Only wait. Ooh. What is this? Oh, my... So this is a kaftan. Oh, my God. This is a kaftan. Guys, you see this? To hide all my lumps. Wow, this is beautiful. Thank you. Would my mask go with this? 
It will. Yes, it will. So tell us, you didn't tell me anything about the cafters, how you said it oh was. Oh gosh, well, I was about the mask, too, but, but she was like a child on Christmas morning, can't yes, wait right, to open right, it. Right, yes. right. All right. <laughs> so, so you're into fashion. So, so, let's, so you're into makeup. But apart from makeup, Beauty Lab is about fashion. Beauty Lab is now becoming one of a fashion oh. um, business. But it was makeup it, before. It still is it's makeup. Still a, oh, okay. Makeup gotcha, is gotcha. our core service. Gotcha. Understood. But I've always loved fashion. I like to bring and I like to look fancy. Where's your horoscope? I, I'm oh God, interested I'm to a know. Leo. Oh, that's why. I'm a you know, you know who's a you know who's a Leo too? Spice. Okay. Miss Spice with her crazy self. Spice like blinging things too. She likes that. So you're a Leo, mm -hmm. and apparently you're a jack of all trades. Yes, I am. Which one is your passion? Which one you like more? Makeup, making cafters, making masks. Which one brings you the most joy? Look, I'm pretty. <laughs> I like she. So I that, like so that have a little bit of uh, makeup and fashion and so you put it all together. Yes, I put it so all together. So basically, you take a canvas, you make her up, she looks pretty. You put on the mask mm -hmm. and you put her in a kaftan. And I dress you. So what's next? You're gonna make slippers and sandals. And well, I things. have some ideas up my sleeve. <laughs> um, all in the beauty in the industry, of course, um, but that is yet to be seen. Don't worry. I, I don't want to spill. Right now. Well, I just want to make a correction. You see in your bio, you said that you are an entrepreneur in training. You are not, you are no longer in an entrepreneur in training. So you, you think how well yes. seasoned. Yes, you have three products. You have your own business. You started it from scratch. And, in, and I, if you go in the dictionary, I'm sure they'll say that an entrepreneur is a person that starts a business from scratch. What again? Takes the risks and enjoys the benefits. So is this profitable? It, it has been. The... The makeup didn't do so well during COVID. Right. As you would understand, everybody is reasons. scared yeah, yeah. and whatnot. But let me tell you how this mask thing started. Mm -hmm. You won't believe this story. I'm going to hear the story. So I'm sitting down in front of my TV set with my husband watching the conferences that they had every other Saturday. Mm -hmm. And this was the day that they made face mask wearing mandatory. Right. So your girl sits in there and I'm like, oh God. Look how everybody look and they see him. They're in a nice suit, fancy dress, and they're all wearing this blue disposable mask. So I tell him, I was like, that can't be me. And he's like, we know that. So what are you going to do? I said, well, let me make fancy face masks. That's what we're talking about. He says, oh, yeah, but you could sew. I said, no, but you, <laughs> everybody learning from YouTube now, you know. Correct. So why not? So I took a huge, a huge wrist dash, I want to mm -hmm. tell you. I just went and I, I quickly designed some mask in my head, yeah. I did a little drawing, mm -hmm. uh, put some flowers together and I did some pictures. Gotcha. And I posted it up on all the social media forums. And I telling him, oh. I say, here, yeah, what, uh, I know about this, you know, but yeah. I went and post it and see what kind of feedback and response I and get. It was good. Here, yeah, what, in 24 hours, I got orders for 52. You hear that? Face masks. That is a blessing. And they were all fully decorated face masks. That is a blessing. So I struggle now. I'm trying to pull up YouTube and I don't know. Well, look, we're going to show the people a little bit of, of your work mm -hmm. right now. This one. Look at this. This is beautiful. Oh, I actually have that one. Good. And I'm taking that too. Show my next one. <laughs> <laughs> So we have these. these I, agree. The, I agree. You know, you can't come on my show and bring things I like get. These are called your luxury wow, designs. Wow. That looks really... Right? Like it took a long time to do. Let me see. It, it does. Especially when you're very, wow. somebody very picky and fussy Guys, like me. Look. And this one as look well. These. And all our masks, the colors are entitled for change. You can change your color. But these look so like, all right, like formal wear, like a wedding. Or yeah. Even like, you, you know, when you're wearing your outfits for the Wally. Mm -hmm. These are beautiful. How can people get in touch with you? Although I know I'm going to say this again, but if they want to get in touch with Amanda, how can they find you? We are, our WhatsApp is 389-9119. You can WhatsApp us, you can call, you can also private message us on our Facebook page, mm -hmm. which is the Beauty Lab, or on Instagram. This is awesome. I see you have two more then. I don't want to yes. surprise these, the These the are more like men fashion. Men. Yeah. Men, we catering for you too. Yeah, but then these are all them? authentic material, Thai yes, material, uh, and we have a little bling going on for you too. I didn't think men had like bling. Ravi, you yes. might like this. This is a Ravi B one. I like this one. <laughs> 
<laughs> we also do face shields. F face shields? Yes, we decorate your face shield for Listen you. Listen that, this so girl this is real a, talented. This is a bridal face shield. <gasps> wow. Yeah. And you have your little glasses to attach. You all see this? Beautiful, right? We do Indian as well, so. And you could put the and glasses attached to it. Yeah, the glasses it. has okay. to attach to it. Nice. That's awesome. That's really awesome. And we offer delivery services. That's awesome. My husband is my delivery driver. <laughs> Listen, so I have to make him up a little bit. That, that's good. <laughs> One last thing I want to ask you before we, we end these series of questions. What advice would you give to someone who is going through COVID and they're feeling depressed, you know, they can't do what they're accustomed to doing, and, you know, you've reinvented, you've changed. Mm -hmm. what, what do you think you should tell someone, you know, in terms of not giving up? You have to live in the moment, and that is what I did. In the past, I, I would not have. I would have stressed and, and think about all the negative things. But live in the moment and follow your dreams and your passion.